Welcome back to the channel. If you're new here, go ahead and like, subscribe, hit that bell button so that you can get notifications and stay up to date on our current and our next investigation. We just investigated CJ Faison's Pokemon Ranch. But before we get into the video, before we roll the footage, I wanted to give you guys a background on some of the occurrences that took place off camera that happened to be more significant than some of the things we caught during our investigation. From chasing phantoms through the woods to whistling in the woods to knocks inside, all of these things caught off camera. This was by far one of the strangest places that we've probably ever been to. Now I know there's talks of, you know, it being haunted or it not being haunted or, you know, it's just some random house out in nowhere. This place did not let us down. From the minute we got there and stepped out of the truck, now granted, we're miles into the woods. The deafening silence that took over was so intense that we had to talk to each other to stop our ears from ringing. Now the energy of this place when we started our investigation had us so scatterbrained that it was hard to complete the investigation itself. I mean, from forgetting equipment in rooms to forgetting equipment in the truck for <laughs> charging equipment, just nothing was getting accomplished. I mean, we were like two school kids chasing each other around a playground. Now, we talked to Chris and we talked to CJ and they just explained that, you know, this is stuff that happens here on a, you know, on a regular basis and it's kind of nice to see that people, you know, have experiences for themselves. But it was intense. It was very intense. Now, most of the things that we caught off film were like, you know, shadows running through the woods, which we thought were people. So what do we do? We chase them. And when we chase them, we find nothing. We find a dead end. And hearing knocks inside, we go inside, there's nothing. You know, seeing lights inside, we go inside, there's nobody there. So these were some of the, the things that we didn't capture, but were almost setting the precedent for the investigation itself. Now, if you guys are looking for a place to go in the tri-state area, if you are in the tri-state area and you're looking for somewhere to investigate, this place is a gold mine. So I'll leave a link in the description with the website on how to book it. It is ghostproperties.com. Prepare yourself if you do want to book it because it is crazy. But with that said, we're going to roll right into the video. Watch it all the way through. Don't miss a beat. Without further ado, this is our investigation at CJ Faison's Pokemon Ranch. Hope you enjoy. T minus 12 minutes from the Pokemon Ranch. How you feel? About to get into it. A little nervous. A little bit nervous. Uh, a lot of stories about this place have said that ley lines exist, that there's portals on this place, structures on, along the, the bridge area, burnt bridge. Um, very, very mysterious location. So we're going to take a lot of time to do walkthroughs and and really get a grasp of what we're walking into tonight so hey -o. hey -o. we'll see that's uh that's old lukey he's a special guest tonight on our search for supernatural uh a little apprehensive luke's a little scared but i mean who isn't it right <laughs> uh what are your feelings about this place dude after everything you've heard um, I think once we get there and we figure it out, I think it will be a lot scarier than when we're in there, you know? Yeah. I think... I don't know, man. I, I've, I think... You think we should split up tonight? I should send you out on your own, or I should send myself out on my own? I think we figure it out when we get there and see how see how it goes. Yeah. See what we find. And we do have a, We do have a meeting with Chris... Now, if you guys don't know Chris, Chris is one of the uh, one of the guys that has investigated this place with CJ multiple times. Has a ton of videos out um, about like terrifying nights at the Pokemon Ranch, all kinds of stuff. Most haunted farm in the U.S. If you haven't seen his channel, it's crazy. Uh, so hopefully, we can get an interview with him and get his take on on what he thinks is going on here and, and go from there. Um, yeah, and we'll check back in when we get there.
Yeah, we got told just last week that um, this property we're we're gonna know here relatively soon, but was more than likely owned by one of the like the most famous people in Delaware that like did a serial lot of killer. Horrendous oh, is that thing. the Patty Cannon thing? I thought I don't know much about it. You know more. Yeah. Delaware's only serial killer, right? Yeah, Patty Cannon. <laughs> so, so you, you so all that dirt in that basement might have bodies in there. Is that what you're saying? There's a potential, I guess. I don't know. Like, we're going to take ground penetrating radar up in there. And, like, we were told not to disturb, like, any of the dirt yet and all that. So, we're like, all right. Yeah, but what the fuck do you do if you find, like, if you find, like, the outline of a body? What do you do then? I'm calling the police and being like, uh, this is really hard to explain, <laughs> but I'm going to need you to just send an officer. I'll explain it to him. Yeah. Then you all can come. Yeah, I mean, books or something. And, <laughs> yeah, like, that's that's a worry. So, but, like, with the So, he could have been where, the, where you said that the hole, the hole in the, the wall brick. is. That's where he could have been putting the bodies in and then... Realty. Filling it in with dirt. So, that. like, the whole Patty Cannon thing know. dates, like, I think, like, what, a couple hundred years ago yeah, or something? Yeah, back in, like, the 1800s. Mm-hmm. Yeah, 1800s. And she used, like, this road here that used to be dirt. And so the whole story of that bridge, like, to give you all a backstory, <clears throat> I started coming to film out here because my grandmother and her friends and all that, they knew I was doing YouTube, and they're like, you got to go out the Burt Bridge. And I'm like, well, I can't even find it on Google. <laughs> what is so it's just like a local <laughs> thing, right? Relax, they started bro. telling me about it, and then all the time when Sonny and I would come out here, it would be so weird. We would always hear noises back here on this property. Always. For years, we were out there on that bridge. I bet I've been to Burnt Bridge close to a thousand times with Sonny. Holy shit. Because we go there sometimes a couple times a day. Really? Or a couple times a night. And then we come back in the day again, but we'd always hear noises back here. And the one night that did us in, we were on the other side of this bridge, more towards the property here, and we were walking, and we were about to set up two cameras and, like, cross them on the bridge. And as soon as I was setting up this tripod, Sonny was setting up that one, and I was about to hit record, and he's like, wait, 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 wait. He turns around and looks, and we heard something on the bridge, and by that time, there was a blood-curdling scream on the property back here. We looked this way towards the property, and Sonny was like, I don't know about you, but... I'm not willing to find out what the hell is out here. So <laughs> after man. that, that's kind of when Sonny, that was Sonny's last time Sonny's ever at the bridge. He was like, I ain't yeah. coming back here. Sonny's only filmed a handful, <clears throat> handful of times since then, too. Yeah. Yeah, he's had some wild shit kind of happen to him. He got run over by a truck. He, like, all God, kinds of damn. shit. Yeah, he fucked with that Ouija board I have. What, you Terminator? I guess. <laughs> he got run over by a truck. He said, I'll he got, be back. He got I'll some kind of back. sickness and damn near killed him. I mean, it was damn. bad. Like, it was... That's why he's not doing YouTube right yeah, now. He's just it. like shit. If I were him, I'd be doing it more. Look, you can't I kill me. Great content. Yeah. <laughs> it's so weird, man. I I don't like it out it's here. Just moving. It's just yeah, fun. dude. I told you when we first pulled up, the first thing we heard as soon as we got out the truck, turned the flashlight on, heard a whistle. Clear as day, like somebody was standing right there, oh, and it was whistling. For me. It was whistling like somebody was whistling at us. Yeah. And then I think I see lights on. I guess it's just the white in the window. So I'm thinking you're inside. Oh, nah. So we start walking down this way. I saw you guys walking up on the camera. I was like, all right, they're going to check it out. I yeah, I, was, I ran. I was dude. at the gas station. I took off running. I was like, nope, I'm out. Yeah, he left me in the dark. <laughs> well, dude, sometimes you got to look out for yourself. Yes, he's, a, he's, a, he's, a, he's a fast runner. I was like, yeah, he's a fast runner too. Yeah, I'll That's leave what... his ass in a heartbeat. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know. I got a pretty good four. Put your running <laughs> shoes on, son. Put your My 40 meters is pretty good. I don't know. I can move. Is the Annabelle doll still in the house, too? Oh, hold on. You heard that? Trying. I heard that over there, but I heard crying right before while we were talking. Yeah, dude, I heard it. Like, like a whimper almost. That's exactly where I heard the whistle. Yeah, it was right around that corner. So that's where the ley line, I haven't told you guys about the ley line, so that's where the ley lines are. According to the people from Travel Channel over there were from. It's like right next to the van. Now, what is down that area? Are you allowed to go down there and um, I'll show look you around? the trail. It goes over to our dock, and the trail wraps, wraps around the backside of this building, essentially. And it's so one where's this homeless guy so we don't okay. run into him? Not super long. Uh, he could be anywhere. I'm not worried about a homeless no, dude. No, the, the water separates us from him. So yeah, that, that dude, cool. he's, he's not dumb enough to come back. He's <laughs> <that's> for sure. <laughs> it sounds like there's somebody up in here. You giant, CJ? No, okay. CJ. <clears> oh, he's gone. Yeah. Right. I had a branch. 
like it swung at me. I was literally standing here and it got like pulled back and whipped at me one time. It was oh, literally right here. Not, dude. I have that freaked me out. I was all by myself. Oh, it's hard to tell with the docks is right there. You can't all the time. It's kind of shitty. We gotta rebuild it. But um, we're gonna off the trail. I did my best to figure it out with the switch here. Mm -hmm. I really do so much, especially winter time. Winter time, yeah. So it's so soft. And just yeah, the ground is super soft. I know, dude. What the fuck? <laughs> I had a buddy, right? He's yeah. like, he's about 400 pounds, six six, and he fucking, he was like, nah, I'm good, man. I'm, I don't know about this this <laughs> farm <laughs> shit. Man, yeah, man. and he backed out, dude. Dude, he, he's the coolest dude ever. It's he, not like he's, he's like a like a piece of shit. He's just scared. We went to the summer mansion, dude, and we all split up. Oh. He was too scared to split up. And I think it traumatized him a little he bit. He's all freaked out from it, as everyone's saying. Yeah, I tried to tell him it was fear bonding, you know? Yeah, you fear bonding. You guys could get closer from that. <laughs> yeah, dude. Uh, and he, did, he wasn't trying to have it. It's like, we call this a witch's tree. I just heard some weird stuff back here, and I've gotten to my spirit box, like, talking about witches multiple times. So I don't know if that's a witch's tree, but I call it a witch's tree. So if you want to investigate back here, it's kind of a cool area. Here's some weird stuff. You want to start outside first or start inside? So Probably inside. I'll just show you quick. So you got the trail we came down right there. Yep. You can go straight up here. And this is the right side of that little shed you saw. Yep. And the That's trail the right here. right there, right? Yep. And then you can see the eagles right there. And if you want to, you can take this one and loops around a couple times and it goes all the way around. So it comes right out. So it's up to you. We can walk there. We can go out right here. Yeah, we can go out right here. We'll venture the, the nighttime trails soon enough. <laughs> I don't know. I think I'm gonna put my wallet in the car. Yeah, that's easy. Yeah. I don't know, yeah, dude. I don't want to see anything. Oh, man. Yeah. It doesn't get easier. Is there anybody up here with us? Can you light up one of these balls on the ground? Step in the doorway and light up one of those balls. They're colorful.
that bottle was full, boy, that bottle was sitting up right here. Let's take a lap. Maybe not. Let's close the door. Yeah. Oh, that shit don't close. God dang. Yeah, oh. Look, there's a light. See the light? What the fuck is that? Hey, yo. Hell nah, bro. I got cold as fuck again. Do you feel that chill? Yeah. What? I'm not really fond of this place, you know? I mean... It got... It got icy cold out here. Oh my god, I, like, I can't feel my hands, dude. You hear that? Yeah. Stop it every once in a while, restart it so that way I don't gotta review 40 minute footage. Alright. You just click the button there, you started it. You yeah. Started with it. Okay. Not bad, that was like a 30 minute. It's alright. So, was it coming from outside or was it coming from inside? Should be picked up on each camera. Yeah, but that. these cameras don't have like the best audio, and the microphone on the digital recorder didn't pick it up either. You heard that? Yeah. What the? What is going on? I don't fucking know. I need to get my IR lights on these because we're about to go off in these woods and find out what the fuck's making this noise. Are you good with the cold? Yeah, can I stop in my truck so I can grab something to eat? Yeah. <laughs> like, I'm freaking, I'm so hungry, dude. My stomach is yeah. all rattling and I feel like it's ruining the video. So we keep hearing, I mean, movement everywhere. No matter where we go, into the barn, to the driveway, it just sounds like there's people just shuffling all over the place. And it doesn't sound like, it sounds like two feet walking. It's not like no animals. You would hear the animals. It's not nothing like that it's kind of crazy we just saw somebody down to in front of us and it's getting creepy yeah it's getting a little fucking weird out here the fact that we keep hearing shit but we can't see anybody where they're running off to where they're going 
unless these dudes know these trail systems like the back of their hand, I don't think anybody's cutting through these thick ass woods. I mean, they're fucking, what, what the fuck are you going to run without a light? Unless you got some night vision goggles on. Did you? I don't know, bro. Bro, oh, this is getting really out of control at this point. I know. Like now, dude, you feel that? The difference down yeah. here? Yeah. The difference, though, dude, the, every time we feel like there's somebody, it's crazy. We walk to where that is, and it's like 10 times colder every time. Ah. <sighs> Man, it's getting. It's getting crazy out here. Yeah, I need it, bro. You have a flashlight. Yeah, that's why I'm leading the way. This is some. This is some like Blair Witch shit. Yeah. I'm... I mean, unless these dudes are fucking with us, because. I mean, it just sounds like. It literally sounds like people are just darting through the woods. You heard that? What was that? You hear that, right? Yeah. I don't know. I don't know what to do, man. This is crazy. It's the craziest. This is the craziest thing I've ever witnessed. I mean, it feels like there's a there's like a party going on out here. And our and right in front of us, and we don't see it. Well, that's the thing. They said those ley lines down by the dock, which is where we're heading, which is like the fucking. They said that's where everything like amps up. But. What the fuck was that? What was that? I don't know, man. I promise you, if any bum walks up on me, it's game over. I'm putting, I'm throwing hands from the minute I see him. I'm not asking Dude, questions. That that battery is really heavy. You can beat me in the head with the battery. <laughs> I'm just saying, yo. What the fuck? That shit's so heavy. Make heavy. sure you're doing POV. Bro. Bro. Dog. I need a fucking second, girl. I'm, I'm getting freaked out a little bit. This shit is getting weird on me. We can go to the bridge and come back. They said we could do that, you know? I know, but I want to fucking find out what's going on here. If there's shit popping off right now, I don't want to just leave, you know what I'm saying? Yeah. Is there somebody in that van? You see that on the left of the van? Like, in the left? Yeah. Looks like someone's sitting in there. Does it not? That's nice. I had to toot, you know what I'm saying? Ah, shit. Come on, bro. Alright. Like trap. You ain't got no more flashlights? Oh, I only got one. God damn. Shh. I mean... This is some of the strangest shit. I mean, it literally just feels like there are just people circling us or something circling us. Like, we're fucking just being watched from every direction. There's cracks and creeks everywhere. I've never, like, guys, when you guys are here, you guys are walking and it's, like, hot in one spot. And yeah. And, like, you Temperature see. Change. So you see something, right? And you mm -hmm. walk Dude. towards it and it's, like, freaking freezing. Yes, totally changed. Okay, so yep, we, we were just at thing. my truck and it was, like, I feel like it was, like, 50 out. Yeah. We saw that thing car crossing the back and yeah. we got back there and my hands were fro like they Isn't froze so weird? like they the tripod it's totally like freezing. it's like and i'll check the temperature, temperature. it's like 40 de three degrees when outside we, right when now when we first got it back last it was at the end of last year early this year we actually had like um these like digital thermometers we put in all different rooms and we would record the weirdest temperature changes within minutes in the basement in the attic it'd go from like a 10 to 15 degree change we, in minutes oh, we oh, went like, to walk up the stairs in the attic times. we went to walk upstairs and yeah. he went to step on the step, and I just got a chill. And I was like, what brick, the hell? It brick wall, dude. It was brick unreal. Wall. And There's we got upstairs, and go. it warmed up a little bit, and then it dropped again. <laughs> so weird. Am I tripping, or is there fog rolling in? 
probably fog roll them. All right. Here's the deal. We're going to walk the trail down to the bridge. Burnt bridge from the house. So we're going to walk straight down. And apparently it ain't too safe. We're going we're gonna to walk it. Yeah, we're we'll not see. Greg, we're not going to be a bitch. All right. <laughs> Greg, if you're watching, <laughs> I didn't say it. <laughs> <laughs> we're gonna walk yeah. the trail. Oh, you're doing it? Yeah, we're gonna no do way. it, dude. Yeah. All right. Good dude. luck. Are you following us down or? I mean, if you guys are walking, dude. I'll just hang out here. It's fine. You guys can just be scared, whatever. Wish us luck, dude. Good luck. That's terrifying. Oh, God. Honestly, better you than me. <laughs> better you than me. All right. Well, you heard it here first. Well, if you guys do uh. anything, I'm only a quick ten minute walk away. So. Dude, you might be like a four second sprint. <laughs> 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 Oh, I fudge. I like I what? have no light on me. Oh, turn them on. How do you turn them on? You just click them at the top. Turn them to the left. Push it to the left. What? Yeah. There you go. Only All right. One it's cold as shit, dude. Yeah, it is cold, dude. All right. I actually don't like this because it's my left hand. So we're walking to the bridge. Not stupid idea. It's not the best. So idea. stupid. Chris. But yeah, we were warned not to do this, but it's for the content. You gotta. You, sometimes you just gotta make dumb decisions to get good results. You know. I don't think it's always smart decisions, smart results. You know. But it's usually dumb, dumb decisions, great results. But you know, we're gonna do it. I can't even see where I'm going, dude. How are we feeling? I'm shivering. How yeah, it's so cold. Hopefully, there ain't no bums out here because they about to get right it's, okay. It'll be volume two of bum fights because I'm going hands on if anybody comes out. Even though we got no hands to go hands on, but I'll drop everything. I'll set my tripod up. Y'all can watch. <laughs> Just so you can see it's not where it is we're going. Sight. I mean, it is pitch black out here. There is absolutely nothing other than like the trail cam behind us. See the trail cam? There is nothing. I mean, nothing out here. Hold up. Damn, bro, you gonna dust me like that? <laughs> No, but I'm telling you. You don't realize this walk is more than five minutes, right? It's alright, come on. We'll be alright. My only problem with this is... So the story of Burnt Bridge apparently dates back to like the 1800s. Where a lady... Now I don't know her name so I'm not going to try and give you guys the real background. But a lady died what the fuck is that? and her baby drowned at the bridge. Now it's a paranormal hotspot, and I know that a lot of people have had experiences there. So we figured, why not try to have our own? But we're probably doing the the dumbest, going about it the dumbest way. Wait a second. I think we're already hitting the point where we're hearing shit. Point of view. I understand that, but I'm going both ways. Well, Luke goes both ways. That's crazy. No, I don't. <laughs> Wait a second. Dude, I mean, I gotta say, for one, walking in the woods down a trail in the middle of nowhere is scary enough, but 
doing it somewhere where you know is haunted and you know is like a paranormal hotspot, it just makes your senses like Spark. so heightened and like you're on like the lookout for anything. But I don't know, I think we can start to see the road, but hopefully, what the fuck is that up there? All right, we've reached the road. Holy shit, I thought I thought was the only We reached the road. Now it's just time to go on the bridge. Which way do we go? Oh shit. There she is. Hold on, I don't know if you guys can see. Point your, uh, point your lights down that bridge. There it is. There's the bridge. All right. This is crazy. Fuck. I don't know why we're doing this, but. Mom, point Dad, your light down there. I love you. No, don't you run on me. What? I said, don't you run on me. What are you talking about? Run away. Bro, it is so, so spooky, man. It's foggy. I don't know what I'm doing right now. I got glasses on my top of my head. I can't see shit. I'll tell you this, man. This is... It's about as quiet as could be. A lady died here in the 1800s, and her, her child drowned here. And they say you can hear what sounds like, I don't know, a baby crying or something. There you go. So, here's the bridge. I don't know, man. Whoa. Now, granted, we are in the woods right now in the middle of nowhere so I and I know there's gonna be creaks and rustling sounds but I mean it's I mean you hear that that sounded like a crying a crying You hear that? I don't know if the camera's picking it up, but it sounds like a lady crying. It sounds like she's whimpering like this is unreal. Now you can see behind me. We're halfway onto the bridge. We're over the water where the where the where the creek runs. I don't know if you can see this, yeah, but I'll so flash it. But it's not really that the, good. There's the water down there. Put the flashlight in the water. That's the water right there. What was that? Go back out there. Creepy feeling, dude. I have a feeling that like someone's watching us, you know? Like every time we look away, they're watching from our right or like our left. It's crazy, man. I've been many places in my journeys, in my <laughs> in my in my background. Oh, you heard that? You got a flashlight, use it. I am. I don't see anything. We just heard. We just heard what sounded like something rustling right there. And I mean, we are the only ones, probably for 
miles, dude. There is absolutely nothing out here. The strangest part about all this is that, like, the silence out here is, like, it makes your ears, like, just ring and ring and ring. Like, I'm just saying, you hear. No, if you turn around, if you feel something behind you, you gotta keep yeah. your, keep your light forward because you have that light behind you already. And then I'll turn. So there's a story about an abandoned house up here. Oh, what? I just heard somebody's voice. Nah, bro, I'm getting I'm getting creeped out. Come on, this is crazy. I just heard the voice of a guy. What? What's your own voice, jackass? You... <laughs> where's that, where's that uh, what? abandoned house at? It's that on the right. The right truck. when you come in? Yeah.
I'm gonna talk about some creepy shit. This is some creepy shit. This is crazy, man. I mean, for thrill seekers around, look, that trail's cut right into the thing. All right, come I don't on. know if you can see it, but that trail is cut right. <laughs> what the fuck was that? <laughs> All right. All right. Let's get back on the fucking road. Let's get back on the fucking road. Keep the fucking flashlight in front of you. <laughs> <laughs> I didn't know he screamed like that. <laughs> hey, yo, what was that? I don't know, bro. Oh, look, there it is. Look. Yeah, all right, let's go. Bro, I don't know. Look, 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 shine your light up there. I don't know if you can see. Right behind me, there's the house. Dude, that was crazy. What the fuck was that? I don't know, bro. I don't know, but I'm not trying to stick around and find out. I think I might be faster than you, so... I'm gonna fucking keep my ass moving. Yo, 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 yo. Find the tips, find the tips. Nah, bro, come on. Stop it. You ain't doing this. Oh, shit. Oh, shit. Hold up, there's somebody over there. No, come on. I ain't doing that. Chill. I'm dead ass. Alright, chill. Come on, I'm not doing this. Yo, yo! Yo, chill. No, dude. You all fucking erratic, bro. Calm down. So, after what I just heard, what was that? There they go again, bro. Come on, bro. I don't play that shit. So you just gonna walk off? Come on, you can't see anything over there. You got a fucking flashlight. Bro. What? There was a lady's voice. Nah, bro. I hear that. Dude, can we come on? Bro, I'm hearing footsteps right behind me. Dude, jump out of here. Oh! Nah, bro, nah, 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 nah. Bro, I'm hearing footsteps right behind me. Dude, jump out of here. Oh, no, bro, no, 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 no. Yeah, right, look at me. Come on! Oh, this is fucking crazy. It's like an old lady, right? Yeah. It's not like you're fucking put something on this. And every time you start walking again. What? Where are we at? We're right around the corner. This car's right there. Bro, I can't see shit. It's like so foggy. Shit, bro. We get down to the trail down here. Yep. Sounds like an old lady. He's like calling to us. Really? But like, it's like, it's so faint. It's, it's like, so faint. Uh, it's like, I don't think the cameras pick it up. No, the mic might uh, get on there. So we're like, he's like, though. okay, come on, let's keep going. Come on, like, just don't even worry about it. Let's yeah, go. Let's keep rolling forward. We get down, here, footsteps. Really? Like, so we get down a little more, here, footsteps. And then, literally, it sounded like somebody was walking right up on us. Really? And then I stumbled back. I saw him start going, and I was like, fuck <laughs> that. looking around like, what well, is I thought it? I just saw a light through there. I swear I, I just saw a light. I've seen lights. Me and TJ traced a light over here over an hour one time, oh. right in this woods. I just saw, see like, that. It, looked like a, it looked like a light. We see that all the time. I don't what know. I think it's paranormal. But. While we were out on the bridge, it sounded like somebody was crying. Really? On the bridge? On yeah. the bridge. See, I've had some weird shit happen out Dude. there. That bridge is fucking crazy. I've had, uh. people, I've had like an actual like whistle like in my ear, like right next to my, I was, it was the daytime Dude. by myself. Dude, 
I keep hearing whistles here. Yeah, I hear them all the time. Whistles. Whistles oh, all over the place. It almost Is sounds like a like an elk call. Yeah, some kind of like animal calling. Dude. Who's in this house? Comedy. What are we funny to you? Channel. What were you just saying earlier? Hmm. That us two together are funny for the channel. Can you give us a name? Tell us who you are. Whoa, my phone's starting to go haywire a little bit. Give us a name. Who haunts this house? See these, these things, man, they, they talk when they want to, they interact when they Devil. want. Devil? You saying the devil haunts this house? I've never had that word come through. Ever. I can't talk. What the fuck? I've been here 500 years. Dude, I want to leave. I'm, I'm not joking with you. Uh... I wanna leave. What caused you to be here? Stay put. You're good. What brought you here? What brought you to this house? Cupboard. Cupboard? Dude, I'm serious. Is there something in the cupboard you want us to find? Or is there something behind the cupboard? Stay put, bro. You're good. Heart. You just say heart, dude. No, I'm, I'm, I'm. I'm le we're leaving. It's very nasty here. Why is it nasty here? What makes it nasty here? that upstairs yes can we get out of here bro stay put i'm not joking with you bro this is fucking scary as shit St settle the fuck down. why are you tripping right now bro it's saying a couple words what the fuck we're good you all right this is what we came here to do why are you scaring my friend luke I think shit's about to kick off. Dude, I don't really want to be here. I'm being honest with you. Bro, this is what we came here to do. I understand that, but bro said devil and 500 years. So what? You heard what they were talking about earlier. So what? Bro. We are good. I'm fucking shivering, bro. 
the fact that I gotta talk you off the ledge because this thing is spitting out words is crazier than this thing's words that are spitting out. I need you to stop scaring Luke. See? That's where he says no, bro. If it says no, we can get the fuck out. Williams. That's my middle name, bro. No, it is not. Mm hmm. Your middle name is Williams. Yes. Luke, well, it's Will Young. Mabel. Is your other name Mabel? No. Dude. Who is Williams and who is Mabel? Or is it Mabel Williams? Is that the name? Mabel Williams. That's a full name. Are you Mabel Williams? It's not really cold in here, bro. Mabel Williams, can you make yourself known? River. There's a river right behind us. Now it's said that water, running water, amps up or amplifies the the energy around places. Coming from outside again. Did you die on the river? If you put all these together, I mean, it starts to write out a story. I'm watch my cousin. I think it's an old ass closet. Like I literally, I feel like, I don't know how to explain Like I feel like I'm losing my train of thought every five minutes. I keep losing where I'm at. I'm losing what I'm trying to do. I feel like I got dementia walking in here. Kind of crazy because it was warm in here about like 10 minutes ago. Yeah. And we went back downstairs. We were up here and it was nice and warm. And we walked up, started to walk up the steps and... Ice cold. Ice cold. I mean, we we jumped back because we didn't realize it. It was warm up here. It was nice and warm. I, I, it's cold. It's really weird. It's, it's, this place is. Yeah, it's trippy, man. This place is wild. Trippy, dude. Can I head to the basement? Yeah, just do some still jumps down there. Big cat business. There's a portal. What the fuck? What the fuck is that? Oh, sorry.
if I'm not mistaken, if the ley lines intersect. And in this corner right here is where there's a portal. I'm going to put this one maybe on this center bar. See if we can't get something to move. Is there anything here with this? This ball's light up. Yeah. You're here from the other balls, they light up. They're colorful. Come yeah. find us some balls. I mean. <laughs> Is that where you come from? Oh man. I don't know man. Just the feel of this place it's uh, on its on its own is enough to, to scare the the novice paranormal investigator away, but I mean, it's just such a weird feeling. It's hard to explain, but it's like, I don't know. It's like you're, you're in like a bubble. And I mean, it's deafening quiet here. Not a sound other than an occasional plane, not a, not a sound in sight. I don't know if y'all can see that. I'm going to put Luke in there. See what he does. Call for the doctor. All right. 